Hey guys, uh, in this video uh, I'm just going to be showing you a little demonstration of Android on the HD2. It's quite recently, about a month ago, two months ago, um, successfully it had been ported to the HD2 or the Leo. Um, it runs pretty smoothly. At first it was quite jerky. Um, the graphics, stuff like the live wallpapers in Android weren't um, as good as they could have been. Uh, the multi-touch support wasn't there, uh, there was no sound, stuff like that. But now everything is pretty much in working order. Uh, GPS works, sending, receiving calls, text messages, uh, data connections, going on the internet, Facebook, Twitter, such stuff like that. Everything seems to be in order. Um, so yeah, I'm going to just show you a short demonstration. Uh, the sound works and everything now, but there are some things you need to do to get that working. Um, I will leave this links in the description telling you how to get all the stuff working, so everything on your HD2. Um, and I'll leave a description uh, link in the description to some of the builds because there are different builds, you know, like there's different Android phones like the Nexus One, the uh, Motorola Droid, stuff like that, the Desire and they all have different builds of Android, some with sense, some without so I'll leave a link in the description to those and you can go ahead and put it on your device so the first thing you'll notice it's quite responsive it's not jerky at all the uh, animations are quite fluid um, I'm gonna put a live wallpaper on and just show you uh, how good they've actually managed to or how well they've managed to port it to the device as you can see there's no no jerkiness in the animation at all it just works perfectly um, I'll show you the browser works fine takes me to Google there as you can see uh, I'll type in I'll use Facebook uh, as an example. Facebook, internet, as you can see, quite speedy. Take me straight to the Facebook site. <coughs> um, it comes with a few programs already in it. All the uh, the hard keys at the bottom, the, uh, they all work. They're all assigned to stuff like if I press the home button at the bottom, it takes me to the home screen, if I press the back button it takes me back, that's if I was on an application if I press the start menu button it will take me to the options or settings menu seems to have crashed out a little obviously you'll get that because it's not 100% um, stable at the moment but uh, apart from that you know there's a few bugs you might notice but I mean everything works quite well as you can see there's a stuff here or oh, the uh, camera works as well and the accelerometer so if I just tell it up at something I can't really see anything there if I just tilt this up you can see keyboard is there keyboard on screen um, so yeah that's about it really for this video just showing you that Android works uh, it's quite smooth um, and I will be leaving links in the description for it everything you need to know about it down there so if you want to try it out go and look in the links if you like the video don't forget to like it if you want to know more or need any got questions that need answering leave them in the comment section and if you want to see more like this then don't forget to subscribe to my channel I also do have a website, uh, www.96edwee.com. If you visit there, it's got the uh, latest information. It's sort of like a tech blog. I post stuff about uh, technology, software, mobile apps, all sorts of stuff like that. So, yeah, check that out. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next video.